Uh, thank you all. Uh, turning to uh, Gord uh, John's uh, six-minute round. Gord. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chair. And I also want to thank all of you for your important leadership in advocating for fishers, for uh, for fish harvesters, processors, all those that rely on seafood from coast to coast to coast. Your testimony is very important and your leadership is very important. Uh, I just want to start uh, by on the West Coast. We know that the government has not come up well, right across our country, hasn't come up with any relief. Uh, in their emergency relief package for independent fishers. They came up with some funding for processors, which certainly was important for workers' protections. On the West Coast, we know fishers are still reeling from the worst commercial salmon season in recorded history, and they're still waiting for help long before COVID hit. Uh, this question is, is for uh, uh, Mr. McIsaac. Mr. McIsaac, can you talk about uh, the importance uh, the economic importance of the industry to coastal communities and the support industry provides as an economic driver for coastal communities. Um, good afternoon, uh, Mr. Johns. Uh, thanks very much for the question. Um, you know, so uh, the industry is uh, incredibly important uh, in in you know for for coastal communities across the country. In Atlantic Canada, uh, the fishing industry is uh, the backbone of the the Atlantic uh, Canada economy. And in the Pacific, it is, it is uh, uh, the, the, the backbone of the fisheries economy here uh, for coastal communities. So it is a huge part. Um, and and the, the benefit of, of fisheries goes well beyond kind of the, you know, just the economic benefit uh, that fisheries provides. So there's uh, huge intangible benefits, uh, the connection to the ecosystem, the providing of food security to, to communities um, are all part of that, uh, you know, the the larger suite of values that fisheries bring to communities. So, so yes, indeed, uh, fisheries are, are hugely important, um, not just on the economic, but in the, the uh, intangible social values that they bring.